You piece of filth. It appears we can't go that way. Looks like some dark precursor stuff. Which Dex doesn't want to touch. Well, actually, that's kind of weird. In the beginning of Jack 2, he claims that that's the last time we will ever touch any stupid precursor crap. And yet, he goes around touching it anyway. Other stuff. Okay. So, this here's a bit of platforming. Which isn't too bad if I can just figure where I'm supposed to go. Oh. Yeah, right there. Okay. Good old platforming. What this franchise is known for. Postman can be a bit annoying, I oh, I guess. Since you can really grab it at any point and it can be hard to adjust it, so it can actually work for you rather than against you. Interesting enough, the platforms are actually respawn when you're not looking, like, very soon. Where am I supposed to... Where am I supposed to go, actually? Oh. I knew that. Um, as I... I think I've said this before, but this is actually only my second time playing through. I'll probably do a hero mode playthrough when I'm done with God War 3. I, I'm playing through using the Blades of Athena and only the Blades of Athena in God War 3, which, yes, you can do that by getting one of the godly possessions. It's going good so far, I guess. I'm so far up to um the Trials of Eurus, which is the three judges of Hades. And it seems we're- oh! Oh god, that was close. I wonder what that what that is. Ooh, sweet. Seems said they lost an expedition of monks on the volcano. I bet they built these gliders to reach the top. Yeah, lost being the operative word. If they vanished, don't you think that was a sign? Hello? Yeah, but you've got me. All we have to do is hit those accelerator rings and we're golden. Oh no! See any feathers here? Looks like fur to me. No feathers, no fly of the axle. There's no way you're gonna get me on some precursor monk crap! Absolutely zippo chance! Forget it, finito! Fat chance! Not gonna happen! Nope! Nuh-uh! Never! Jack! One of my least favorite missions. It's long, it's annoying. Steering can be annoying, like, you have to hit every single one of them, unless you can get lucky and bypass one. Like, over time, when you're near the end, if you're just about to reach one, it will end the meters almost at zero. Then you're basically fucked. You cannot do a thing. Aren't we happy? Good thing I don't have a fear of heights. It'd be a nice touch if Daxter was actually screaming at some point, like when you're going like it. Ah! It'd be pretty funny, really. Make this much more bearable and fun. So, as the tutorial explained, you have to hit all of the yellow pots in order to open pots to open them, or else. Well, like I've said several times, you are screwed. I guess I'm doing half. Okay. They want you to use the, um, the blaster. You can have another gun at this point, actually. The Vulcan Fury, but I didn't go for that. I probably should have, actually, make the next mission a bit more fun and easier. But I, I don't like when things are made easier. Oh, oh, oh! Hmm, I haven't died yet. That's, I jinxed myself, didn't I? It's 
So yeah, if you die, um, your blast jump will be completely replenished. You really shouldn't use the refractor mod. It doesn't really make a difference, if at all. Won't save you any ammo or having to aim if you're being lazy, but... Oh! I'm actually not dead yet. I'm surprised. I'm really surprised that I didn't die yet. As you can tell, I'm cutting it pretty close, but... Well, now we can't go back the way we came. Let's go check it out. Right behind you, partner! Far behind you. <laughs> 